Hi guys, this is our local called the Rosen Spring. The PNR is missing, and we today we're gonna review this pub where we go quite often and to get booze. No, no, we just go there to have chai because we're really nice people. So this is what we're gonna be reviewing today. And are you excited, Louis? She's always excited to drink alcohol. Oh my god! Yeah. Oh god. <laughs> Okay. Welcome to my crib. <laughs> okay, turn it off. <laughs> no, no. Look at this. Wow. Modern art. What is this for you? This is what I'm gonna look like with my new swimming costume. Wow, like a zombie? <laughs> wow, it's massive. So big. Jim. That's your favorite drink, please. Look. Huh? You see your favorite drink? Yeah. Do you like Jen? Oh, you're so cute. Are you recording? Mm-hmm. Are you having a good time? Yeah, I'm gonna we're gonna order some drinks. Just a couple of drinks. It's like we're not gonna get drunk or anything. But <laughs> speak for yourself. I mean yeah she is. But after that we're gonna go check out the smoking area because we literally did not know there's a smoking area outside. Not that I'm gonna smoke, but it's just a really nice outside area. Yeah, and we're gonna check it out. And I'm gonna check out that machine too. It's a, it's a jackpot machine and then we're gonna be really rich. <laughs> We just stopped by on the shop, like at the shops for a second, and Louis being the shopaholic. You know, peacocks is they used to be everywhere, and then they just started closing down. I thought then, you meant the birds. They used to be everywhere, <laughs> and now they're just disappearing. I mean that too. You know, fight for the peacocks, mm -hmm. and like so good. This is like eighteen down to seven, and it was really stressful, guys, because they were closing. It does look nice. Um, yeah, but I got this, so I need to try it on when we get back. But I just, I just gave in to the pressure. But the only reason we started shopping is because I need a swimsuit. And then I also got this for seven pounds. What is that? As long as it covers my bum, I would keep it. I probably don't need this. I'll probably return. Oh, oh. <laughs> Gonna return it. The fire looks so cool behind you. Huh? The fire. Do I not look cool? You you look hot, and the fire looks cool. You know, nice. you know I'm saying. You know what I did there. You know what I mean. No, and I'm... this is my because Hash and I go swimming loads now at the swimming pool nearby. So you know, watch out, Tom Daly. <laughs> 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 and so I needed to get a serious swimmer's costume. So mm -hmm. that's what this is. Looks nice. Yeah, I'm gonna look so hot in it. <laughs> Thanks, I'm just gonna have some chips now. <laughs> okay, so Hirsch is about to try Strongbow Dark Fruits for the first time. Now, I'm gonna start with how it looks. I mean, this is like a regular cider look. And this is a Strongbow. <laughs> dark, what is it called? Dark fruit. It's not yeah. normal fruit, it's dark fruits like me. Yeah. Dark fruit. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> it's, it's cidery without being like too sweet. Mm -hmm. I think this this would be such a good summer drink. It's nice right now too. It's not really cold outside. I mean, it's it's colder than India. If you're watching in India, I mean. <laughs> Hello, uh, friends. Hi, guys. <laughs> when can I come back? Stay alive. <laughs> oh God. Mm. But I really like. Why don't you like this? It's so good. Okay, I'm gonna try some now. Yeah. So she's trying the the dark fruits thing, and she said she doesn't have it because it's so tacky. Only peasants drink it. Look, <laughs> look at that. Look at that bourgeois laughter. Yeah. Okay. Now have your sugar syrup now. Yeah, I mean, it's fine. I can I can drink it. It's nice. It's not too fizzy. And it's not too sweet. Yeah, literally, this is so sweet compared to that. Exactly. Maybe that's why I like it. Maybe I need to drink this one. <laughs> Maybe we need to not spill our drinks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now she's look look at the classic English girl. Got every drink on the table. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's 
see if I can do them both at the same time. <laughs> okay, do you, so compare them. What is the comparative analysis? Which is the better drink? They're good in different ways. This is nice if you have a sweet tooth. Like so, me. I, what is it exactly, this one? This is strawberry and lime, mm. Uh huh. But if you're vegan, don't be fooled for recorder leg because their strawberry and lime, I'm pretty sure, isn't vegan. Mm. Just top tip for you. But this is made of cow blood. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I don't know if this is vegan. Well, uh-uh. I mean, it's a cider. It can't have meat. Yeah. That's what they want you to think. Hashtag vegan. <laughs> <laughs> Our snacks are here now. And Louise is messing with the menus. So we got a side of chips and a tiny vegan pizza. All Louise's choice. <laughs> You gotta do it like Salt Bay. Huh? Do it like Salt Bay. Yeah, that's what I was going for. Well, it's gonna be so salty now. So. No, okay. No. Do you like this? Pretty sure that's not how. <laughs> no. You look like a penguin. <laughs> it's gonna be really salty. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This pizza looks I'm gonna have a tiny good. piece of the pizza. Okay. So it's a vegan pizza, guys. The only reason we're having it is because Luis is vegan. So this has no cheese. So it's basically not a pizza. Uh, and what is the definition of pizza then? Cheese. <laughs> but to be honest, the first pizza did not have cheese. Fun fact. <laughs> yes. But we are in 2020 and Brexit has happened. So veganism is shameful. I mean, making fun of Italian food in the current atmosphere is just not good. <laughs> okay, let's see. actually decent. You nice! So guys, Louise has just deep, like deep down into reading the Wellspoons magazine, trying to learn about the two sides of Brexit. <laughs> I never knew where to find out information about Brexit and I just needed to go to my local Wellspoons. Oh, okay. Fantastic! So, just a tip for all of you out there, like, Get drunk and read the news. Yeah, at Weatherspoons. Yeah. I'm just gonna do a quick panoramic shot just to show you how cool this place is. So big. Massive. We've got two little dining rooms down there. Two more dining rooms down there. And now we're gonna head to the smoking area to finish our drinks just to check it out. Louise has a smoking problem. What do you have to say about your smoking problem, Louise? Huh? Oh, I can't stop. I know. <laughs> like... It's been, we've been in here for half an hour and I think I'm gonna die. Yeah, let's go out and smoke. Yeah. Cool, okay. Oh. Did you recording? <laughs> yeah. <Just> tell me. <laughs> Alors, suivez-moi. Je vais vous montrer ce qui est dehors. Voilà, donc, c'est l'espace fumeur. Ce qu'on appelle en anglais beer garden. Ah! You know, <laughs> pas utilisé parce qu'il est parce qu'il fait nuit. Do you think we could go there and they would light up the light there? Mm, we could try. Okay, let's check that out. So we went outside. It, it is the biggest beer garden I've seen in a pub in Sheffield. It literally is like a space there and a space outside it. Then there's another space that is just by the river. It's massive. Like we just so want to go back there on a sunny day but right now they don't have heating outside like those heating lights. So Louise was freezing. And she's English, but she was freezing. So we, come we have cold drinks too, okay? No, I was fine, but yeah. <laughs> so now, now, now Hash is gonna um, use his literary skill to uh, interpret this this uh, painting. So you don't really use literary skill to interpret painting. It's called visual art, but <laughs> but you have words. Yeah, look at that. Do you see a woman? And you know poems. I see a woman. What do you see, Louise? Uh, I see a, like a jungle with a path. Oh, so you just see a path there? Yes. And this is the jungle? Yeah. What I see is a woman, that's her face, that's her hair, and this is the darkness inside her. Aww. I also see something that is one of those pictures where I'm a really annoying person that would be like, oh, I could just paint that. And like, why would you want this in your house? What would this bring? Well, see. You're right with the interpretation, which is called the forest please. Ah. Yeah. But it's not what the work of art is, but what you make of it. 
you know, once you read a book, it doesn't belong to the author anymore, it belongs to you. So Louise sees a forest and I see a woman. So that means she is vegan and I'm straight. <laughs> It doesn't mean Zahash is wrong and he can't accept it. No, I'm not. <laughs> so we just got a spot at the fire. We've been waiting for this for so long. Look how much Hash just fits in. I mean, I was gonna go to the toilet, but then I saw there's a place empty here. And I just had to go and sit here. And this is like, this is the first time we've managed to get a seat here. Mmm. So fancy. It would be so nice to sit and read here, right? Yeah. Uh, no, it's probably a gas or electric fire. Yeah. Still yeah. Hmm. I'm gonna go to the toilet. <laughs> okay, so now we gotta we gotta review the the local. So yeah, I I really like the local. I recently found out terrible things about where the are and the owner is a massive Brexiteer. But in the end, I also think we shouldn't <laughs> like judge a work of art. By the author's biography. <laughs> so this particular weather school is very nice. We get cheap breakfast, great drinks, the building's great. So I like it and but I don't I'm against what Brexit stands for. Fuck <laughs> Brexit. <laughs> okay, so give the people wanna know what is the rating? So I give it 350 million pounds for the NHS. <laughs> And I would give it um, I would give it seven out of ten. Are you shaking the camera so much, Louise? Seven out of ten lampposts. Okay, my lamp arm. Posts. Yeah, my arm hurts now. So bye guys. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Tram from the tram. I love trams. Yeah, remember, if, if you forgot how much he loves trams, just go to our last video. <laughs> A good plug. Well done, Luis. <laughs> He's a professional. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.